I'm going to show you how to create a Discord server verification system using Probot. First thing you're going to do is go to your browser, preferably Google Chrome, and you're going to go to probot.io, and you're going to hit login. After you've logged in, you're going to hit the Add to Discord option, and you're going to select your Discord server, and then hit Continue and authorize all of these, and confirm you're a human. Once you've done that, that's going to bring you here. And from here, we're going to go back to our Discord server. And as you can see, Probot has been added. But we're going to go up to the top left and click on the server name, and go down to server settings. Once you're in the server settings, we're going to go to roles. And we're going to go to our at everyone permissions. We're going to select that and go to the permissions option and hit clear permissions. And then hit save changes. Then we're going to create a new role. And this is going to be our verified role. So we can name it verified or whatever you would like it to be named. And the permissions that you're going to put are whatever you want the permissions to be when you're verified. So probably just the default permissions. Once you've done all that, hit save changes. And you want to make sure that your probot role here is above your verified role in your server. Once you've done that, you can exit out of the settings here. And now we're going to create a text channel. So just hit the plus icon. And this is going to be the text channel for where you verify your account. I'm just going to call it verify. Then create that channel. And I'm going to go to the edit channel to go to the settings. I'm going to go to permissions. And I'm going to select the at everyone role. And I'm going to turn on two options here. I'm going to do the view channel. And I'm also going to scroll down and find the read message history option and check that on as well. And then hit save changes. I can exit out of this. And now we're going to go back to our browser to this page here. We're going to select our server on the left and then go to embed messages here. We're going to create an embed. I'm going to give it a name at the top. Below this, you can do an embed if you'd like. I'm just going to hit message. And I'm going to say react to verify. And I'm going to hit save changes at the bottom. And then at the top right, I'm going to hit send new message where it says choose a channel. I'm going to select the verify channel I just created and then hit send new message. And if I go back to my server, that's going to send that message in my verify channel. Now I'm going to come back here. I'm going to go to the left and scroll down to the self assignable roles. And I'm going to hit add message. And once this pops up here, I'm going to hit edit. I'm going to hit the select and embed and select the verify one that I just created. And I'm going to go to choose a message and choose the message that I just sent. After that, I'm going to come down to the self assignable role type. You can select whichever one you'd like, but I'm going to do reaction. I'm going to hit the add an emoji option. And I'm going to do the white check mark because I think that's what looks best for this. Then if I hit this plus icon here where it says select roles, I can select the verified role that I just created. And I'm going to scroll down. And I don't want it to be able to toggle, so I'm just going to do give so that they can only receive the role. Then after that, I'm going to go to the bottom and hit save changes. And now when I go back to my server, it has added that reaction. And now I'm going to invite my other account so we can test it out. So I joined on my other account. And as you can see, the only channel I can see is the verify channel. And I can see this message here. And if I react to that, 
it then gives me the verified rule and it also gives me access to the other channels in my discord server that i have given it permission to i hope that this video helped you guys out please remember to like and subscribe